In this video, you'll learn tips and tricks to improve the animation in your brick films. To jump to a specific chapter, just click one of these boxes. As a beginner, it's okay if your animation is a little choppy. Try increasing the playback speed when you're ready. To get smoother, realistic animation, a technique called easing in and out is used. When objects start to move, you ease in. Start with a very small movement, then increase the distance of the movement with each frame. Keep increasing the distance until the desired speed is achieved. When objects need to slow down, you ease out. It's the same thing, only in reverse. Minifigures are probably going to do a lot of walking and running in your movies. To help keep the steps consistent, walk and run cycles are used. Here is a frame-by-frame -frame breakdown of a walk cycle at 10 frames per second. Here's a frame-by-frame -frame of a run cycle, also at 10 frames per second. Feel free to practice and use these cycles in your own movies. Unfortunately, LEGO minifigures can't actually fly. But there is a way to make objects appear to be flying. Make anything hover in mid-air by supporting it with transparent studs. If a figure keeps falling, try using some putty to secure it in place. Find it at any crafting or office store. It's the stuff you put behind posters. Some LEGO figures may not have movable arms or legs, but they can still be animated. You just need to find creative ways to move them, like rocking back and forth. Now you're going to learn how to make some cool brick effects. Some minifigure heads have two faces. While animating, try switching the faces to give your character new expressions. Water effects can be built with blue and clear transparent bricks. Experiment with the bricks you have to see what you come up with. Laser gun effects are simple. Pick a color for your laser and attach the laser beam to the gun. Use a flashlight to light up the scene. Take a picture. Now take the laser and hold it at the edge of the frame. Take a picture. Window breaking effect. You'll need a window before and after it gets broken. Transparent studs will work great for the broken glass. Take the first picture before the window is supposed to break. Then replace the glass with the studs. Animate the pieces so they fall and randomly spread apart. These are just a few examples of the cool effects you can create. Use your imagination and experiment at home with your own movies.